Hey, hey, what's up everyone? And I'm back with Mix Daily Trading. Let's go and let's have some fun. All right. All right. Planes P dealer. Wait, what? Am I black? Wait, wait, wait. I'm white. Why can't I play a move? Hmm. Something is interesting. Ah, oh, he declined. Bam, ba 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 bam, ba 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 bam. I think. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Hello, good luck against Super Dragon. Mm hmm. Sneaky trap. But this one did not. Uh, well, technically, it did work. <laughs> Oof. Saying hello, good luck is not winning. Definitely not. Ooh, maybe some chance. No. I don't think he has any chances. And he blocks it. Yeah. Key. Which way six? He takes up. Ouch. Ouch. It's a bit weird play, but no one seemed to blunder, so... Ooh! That's interesting. Oh, wow! 97 isn't great. <laughs> it, 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 it didn't create a challenge and I was trying to uh, game play against Halet Fahori. And hello, good luck one. Well, hello, let's see. Hello, good luck to Halet. B4. Okay. E3. Alright, these should be two. Mm hmm. It takes E, D four. All right. Here, Bishop D three. Let me play a4. I think a4 may be interesting with a3 in future ideas, but he does not. Let's cancel then. I think he'll play bishop g7. Oh, bishop h6. That's interesting. I think I'm gonna play knight queen e2 then. Yep. Here. Mm hmm. Maybe h3 just to prevent knight g4 and knight e3 ideas. True. Okay, it doesn't go for a3. Then I think I will play knight bd2. Here or d5 or e4. Looking good. Ah, let's play e4. Aha, uh -huh. his idea is knight f4. Create some problems for me there. Mm -hmm. I see. Mm -hmm. 
actually on an now understood that bishop c2 is knight g3 so i'm kind of needed to play queen f2 to prevent a knight f4 i'm not preventing knight f4 but it won't be so bad uh and i'm preventing knight g3 yeah i think here g5 is interesting but there he has knight c5 i'm not so sure actually there um I'm not sure bishop c2 then. g4 is an interesting idea. That's why I played bishop c2. Just so after knight f4, after g4, not only my h3 pawn would hang, not, by, not my bishop also. He okay, goes for bishop f4. Uh huh. I think if g4, knight g3, rook f1, his knight may get stuck there. So let's try it out. Knight g3, rook f e1. Mm -hmm. Here. E5 is interesting. Yeah, because right now his knight is completely stuck. If I play E5, I'll cut his knight. E5, D5. Maybe it's interesting, so I'll try E5. Mm hmm. F5 is interesting idea. <laughs> G5, knight here. Is Play d5. <sighs> oh well, I think I may have blundered. F takes g, h takes g, then bishop d2, and then I am forced to play queen g3 and be an exchange down. Yeah, this. That if bishop d2, I cannot take with queen because of rook f3. I can take with knight because of rook, at, uh, rook f2. So yeah. Yeah, it goes for it. I think it will be cool trying to play an exchange down, trying to make a clutch comeback win. Because yeah, queen d2, rook f3 is, I think, definitely worse than that. Hmm. Ah, uh, maybe a yes, queen c4 here? Seems like that? Not sure. He goes for that. Okay, bishop b3. Now, if queen f4, I have d6 check, then e6 check. You need to be careful about that. If queen c5, I have bishop d4, rook f3, and I need to be careful. And I guess I cannot be careful. Yikes. Yeah, that is probably the sin I did not see. I thought after rook f3, I can just. I didn't even see rook f3. Yeah. Definitely. Let's see. Bishop d4, rook f3, this is this, king g2, bishop e1, rook e1, uh, d6, let's say, king h8, queen b7.
check and yes bishop d5 that have a speed blunder i did not see bishop f4 nice nice one from halet Queen F2. Yikes. Oh, it does did, did not take. Let's play King H3. I'm gonna try to create some counter play. Seeing Queen F2 would win immediately, but actually not because King H1 then Bishop D5 also have some counter play there. Poo, 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 poo. Sees that yes, bishop p1. I think I'm pretty much lost. Yikes, yeah. Oh, yeah, that was pretty bad game played by me, and I think pretty well played by my opponent. So, very deserved win from him. some chances oh, I don't think there is many chances but maybe some let's play bishop c1 try to keep my bishops because I think if I would give my bishop away immediately that would not be good if we play bishop 8 and give away b2 bishop I mean I'm Halet Fahori. Good game. He's from Jordan. Good game. Okay, uh, let's log off. Let's analyze the game. So yeah, I think I already got pretty much worse position from the opening. Sees. Mm, it was fine. Basically without super many mistakes. I got worse. Okay, that was like an mistake to go for rook d1 knight h5 z's then f5 that was a mistake i to take e takes f i didn't even see empathant no it wasn't good 204 i don't know g5 c5 and it would be better and f takes g the rest was pretty clear i won't really say we both made any mistakes <laughs> near me to lose him halad fahori okay just Okay. Let 
C. Fiti Miti one two three against Daenerys Targaryen. I think Fiti Miti is better. <laughs> Maybe winning. Ui. Ui. Sorry. To play against someone else. Fiti Miti with one point nine seconds. No, Fiti Miti. Clutch win by Fitty Mitty one to three. Whoa. That was dominated by him. Let's see. <gasps> VTV team is completely winning at last in time. Um, oy, 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 VTV is pretty aggressive with his pawns. Um, I think he's winning. Yes, he should be. Let's see if he will win. They gotta be, gotta be winning. Oh, they played in total 300. Ooh, that's a lot of games from they played in total. 330 plus 2 that's 560 560 570 games 570 games that's a lot of games I think Pity Mitty is completely winning but maybe you won't have enough time. And Bishop of Five Rook H7. Bishop of Five Rook H7. Yikes, yeah, Fiti Miti. is a bit too slow at the end game where he's completely winning. Ouch. Ooh, a piece. Oh, that one opened. Wait. I think I already played you. Sorry, I want to play in someone else. Okay. Let's see. Fifty meters again. Completely better, uh, but he's no time, and now he's not better, and he lost out. Well, after this game, I'm gonna switch to rapid. So, Fiti Miti is three points up. Completely winning. Will he win it with one second? Ah, yeah, 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 that was wrong. Oof. No, he, yeah, he just doesn't have time. And what's the H random against Com is 12.0787. Okay, super confinado against Mr. Abel. I played against confinado. It seems actually once. Three weeks ago. Oh, yeah, here I got smashed. Here I definitely got smashed. Oh, let's go back. Ooh, Fitty Mitty. Fitty Mitty is winning. 
Ah, that hurts. Just two, two bones. Eyes, peace, and a pawn up. They do it. Okay. Oh well, there is no opening. Wait, how can I do my challenge? Just go for you. <laughs> um. So yeah, no one at play chess. Let's go to chess twenty four and try to play a game there. And play against F F V R Gainer. He's from Austria. Hello, smile, good luck, smile. And let's play. Fifty minutes. Yes, he won. <laughs> I don't know. Feels. <laughs> He did not win for so much. Okay, let's see. C4. Pretty unusual opening, actually. Don't remember it a lot, to be honest. Knight C3. Okay. So, so, so. I think you'll play like knight f6 probably. But not sure. Usually knight c6 is pretty unusual. Move. Not really often it's been being played. Especially in d4. And then knight, uh, knight f3, knight c6 first move. I think in this type of position, knight is usually on d7, and then it's pawn from c7 either on c6, either on c5. So yeah, here I will play bishop d3, because knight on c6 is in the way of c7 pawn. He takes, I'm gonna take. I think knight d5 is pretty basic idea in that position, so maybe he will play it, not sure. b6. That's another also really unusual move with knight on c6. Usually, when knight on d7, it's yeah, like b6, bishop b7, and c5. But when knight is on c6, I also don't remember a lot of cases where this happened. Okay, let's see. This. Yeah, I don't want to give away a bishop, so I'll play bishop d3, and here he found c5 maneuver. That's actually a very good play from him. Yeah, nice job. Very good, very, very good. Let's see. We'll take him and play bishop f3 and make my construction bit, though I think it's not a disaster. Here, knight e4 does not work. A3. I mean, I guess b4 trap is very well seen, of course. 
I'm not scared of bishop f3 because then fg takes f. And but well, he needs to play or knight to c6 or move his bishop back. And losing, yeah, losing a tempo is always not the most enjoyable scene, let's say so. Yeah, knight c6. Basically, he even. I'm not sure how many tempos, but he definitely lost some. At least one. I think my plan may be knight c6, queen e2, then rook fd1, bishop b1, queen's 2, and try to mate him. Okay. So, so, so. It's currently sinking. Let's see, ninety five. That's an interesting move. I think I won't go away from my plan. So it's either I'll play bishop g3 or I will play... Maybe I'll actually play bishop g3, bishop f6, I so like knight e4 idea. And uh, yeah, knight c3, just rook c3. I didn't want bishop e7 because it feels like I lose the initiative. And bishop g3 looks pretty cool. Maybe I lose the tempo, yeah, but... Uh, but and what? I lost the tempo. What then? I think I didn't lose a piece or a pawn, so if I did not lose piece or a pawn, everything is perfect. You go to CC1. Okay. Okay. See rook fd1. <coughs> now my threat is bishop d6, and if he'll take bishop h7, and if he won't take, I'll take his rook by his skewer. So that is good. Ooh! Look at that! And if he'll play rook f or rook a, d8, I have b5, he needs to move his knight, and rook c7, but okay. He prevented my idea. Nice. Nice play, I guess. Let's see, bishop e4. Yeah. Attack the knight. Prevent an e4 at the same time. a big time advantage. Oh, that's an interesting move from my opponent, actually. B takes A as bishop e4. Oh, wow, wow. That's sneaky. Uh -huh. Nice plan. F knight d2. Then he's forced to take on e4, then I'll take on e4 also. Then knight b7, that seems like he will be very passively placed. So let's let's try it out and see what will happen. <coughs> Please excuse me. Okay. Takes takes knight b7, I think is forced, right? Yeah. Oops, 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 oops. I made something wrong. Uh, let's see. Queen of 3 and queen g4, my candidate moves. I like queen g4 a bit more, so I have rook d7 threat with rook b7 and rook e7 threats with double attack. And I think 
if he will let me play it, I will just win. So he needs to play rook d8, no matter what rook I think, or rook fd8 or rook a d8, and then I guess we'll see. I can even go rook d7 no matter what. Let's see, queen d7, knight f6, I win a queen. If rook d7, I play knight f6, he's forced to take. Queen d7, and now he's... He can play rook b8, then I have rook c8, and I should win. Or it should be better. And he also has knight d6. Rook, and then I can play queen a7, I'm a pawn up. That looks cool. I'm gonna double check just to make sure I don't miss anything, let's say. Um... And I think it's my move that I will play. Yeah, let's go for it. Rook. And that is interesting. If you place rook c8, I have rook cd1. So he's forced to take with the rook. Then knight f6 is forced if I don't want to lose. And then I'll be a pawn up. And I think from that position to a pawn up is pretty cool. Queen e7. Knight d6, queen a7. I can play rook c6 just to make sure his knight won't go away. Then he'll probably play rook d8. Then I have bishop e5, but I'm not sure. It just doesn't feel good. So, queen a7. Well. <laughs> Always like being a a a a a a, a pawn up, and here I'm a pawn up, and I think also pretty cozy position. It's like queen b7 attacking his knight, then kind of forcing him to take on g3, and I also have rook c6 threat. Look at that, and then my I do, I won't take on b6, and also e5 pawn may hang. So takes takes now rook c8 and rook c6 are the ideas, though. So, I like my position! <laughs> if rook d8, probably I'll just trade the rook off with rook c8. I think I will do it. Yeah, rook c8. Mm -hmm. I think queen d6 if he doesn't want to trade rooks and prevent me from playing queen c7 or, some, or queen b8. But yeah, I guess I'll still be fine after rook trade there. Okay. Takes, takes. And I'll give a check on C2. Then queen b3. Ooh, he made a huge blunder. That pawn was really important. Really, really important. Now I can play king h2 even. Just like queen d1, queen g6. Queen d2, queen g6. Queen f2, queen h6. So queen d2, queen g6. He takes, I take on h6. King g8, queen g5, check. He moves his king, queen e5, and I'm four pawns up. <laughs> I think being four pawns up is pretty cool. Yeah, he goes for h5. Interesting idea. Maybe a4, look at that. Queen b4, queen g6, queen a4, queen b6 or even queen h5 queen e5 he has so exposed pawn structure i'm just completely winning i think a4 is a beautiful move which i really needed to find maybe it's not perfect by stockfish but it feels great queen g6 Ooh, that looks good so basically i have two things i can play queen b6 and he has so exposed pawns. I can play queen h5, king g8, queen... Yeah, I think I'm going to be greedy and take all of his pawns. 
So no matter what, I'll give a check and win his pawn. And with that pawn, I guess I'm gonna win the game. I can play queen f4, trading queens. Queen f4, g takes f. Oh, he just gave up, and all game. F V R gainer, he's from Austria. Good game, smile, thanks, smile. Yes, I think I would manage to realize all that advantage, so yeah. Let's see, that was pretty good. Cool, uh, cool game, knight. Of, yeah, that's basically next. Just like I don't know, knight of six, d five. Um, these, these. I think he maybe played the opening a bit weirdly. B six. Yeah, it was actually a right idea. I'm not a biggest pro in that position, so yeah, that was actually a mistake. Let it go for b takes c. Uh, it's equal. A3 is a mistake for me. I to go for queen e2. And basically, yeah, with my ideas only. I made them a bit later. Bishop e7 is a mistake back. He. Oh, wow, he had knight b3. Look at that. Takes, takes. Rook b1, bishop e7. And he has two bishop advantage. Two bishops advantage. And I cannot really take because of queen d3. Wow. And that's it, sequel. B4. Again, no, I did not lose the advantage. This Yeah, E5 was a bit of not the best move. Yet go for rook f d8. And that would be equal. Bishop b4 is fine, then bd2 would be knight d2 would be better. That's a mistake from him here to go for rook a c8. Holding that pawn h4, rook f d8. Try if I'm better. And here we both messed. Look at that. That's an actual blunder for me. To go for bishop f5, attacking his knight. And if he goes knight b3, I play rook b1. His knight is under attack. Rook d7 is a threat. And I'm completely winning. And I will win. These. But okay, bishop b4 was a blunder back. He had to go for knight b3. Only move actually. Rook c2, knight d2. And that's equal here. Knight e4, this, then that. That was actually a mistake. I need to go for rook c6. Would be winning with knight f6 threat. Yeah, basically understandable. Rook a d8, this, this. I think it was still fine, but okay, that wasn't. Had to go for queen d6 still. With compensation because, yeah. Basically. in a way and that and that was another last blunder king g7 still with some compensation and that and here this this queen f4 wait boom queen f4 would have been a huge wait why oh here it actually is the best move ha ah. yeah that would have been a huge blunder so queen f4 that b5 and he's winning but after king f6 he just gave up and i want to f v Eirger is from Austria. Games on chess 24. See, how much didn't I play on chess 24? Last game was 8 of October. Oh, this game was just a month ago. <laughs> and then in September. Oh, yeah, here I got smashed. Here. I played that so. What was the first game? What was it? I often just want to show. Oh well, oh well, oh well. Nice. Let's go here. Whoa. Ultra lucky GM against C9, C9, C9. Oh well, puzzles. Let's solve this. I really like rook b2 as a candidate move. Basically, rook b2, king b2. Whoops. Queen here. Queen a1, rook b8, but then queen f7, and I lose. I don't like this anymore, actually. 
I don't know why, but <laughs> but I'm out. <coughs> right, <clears throat> start to really don't like it. I see. Rook b6 is looking good for this rook c6 threat. He'll go for d5, then rook b2 is a candidate move. Let's go. Yeah. So basically, if queen a4, <coughs> why now? I would take just more mate threats. Queen d3, easy move. I will not think about. <coughs> Making this move by intuition. I like queen c4 or something, for example, yeah? A queen c4, b4, queen d5. Oi, 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 I messed up. This and rook eight is a threat, and I don't think he has defense from these. Still, queen d5, rook eight seems good, no? Queen d3 here. Yeah, this, and I think just queen d1. And uh, let's see. This hangs and my rook hangs. I don't have any check which would be good. F5 would be a good square. We could protect both. E8 is also a square. I'm not sure if I can get there in time. Queen E7 is not. Ah, Queen G4. Perfect. <coughs> Let's see. Queen E6. Takes king h5, king e8, king g6, king f8. I don't have anything. I think maybe I can play king h6, but then king f7, and I also think I don't have super much. Yeah, I think so. Queen g8, queen g7, f6. No. Was it capture? Yes. King h5, king g6, and then... Wait, let's see, c4? Yeah, just to Zook's one game. Ah, makes sense, yeah. Mm -hmm. I see, I see. Whoa, that's pretty wild puzzle, actually. <laughs> Whoa, a lot of fast pawns. I like c2. Yeah, because b2, rook b1, I can play c2 because of rook b2, so c2, b2 idea. I guess I need to take. Well, I'm not sure who would not take a free rook. Ooh, it was actually wrong. Wait, king b3? Wait, what? No. Do I play c1? Oh, wow. Whoa. That was pretty wild. Wow. That was cool. Boom. Okay, let me explain slowly. So, basically, I think yeah, rook d8, he is forced to go here. Rook f7, he is forced to take. Rook g8, if king h6, there is knight of 7 mate, and that just mate. Okay. And just the mate you have seen. Wait, f4? Oh, I thought f4, king g4, and I play bishop b2, that's mate, but I didn't see the bishop. Haha. <laughs> F four. No. Okay. Let's see. Do I just take? No. It's also not these. Ah! Check. Now I play. I play G4. Hey, what's the difference between F4? Beautiful. Um, hmm. Oh, I was just blind. No. No. Show lines, yes, please. Bishop a6 and a g7. Okay. Uh, but why not? 
what? King g4 here, here. Yeah, ah, basically true. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I think I've had this puzzle. I don't remember the solution, but maybe I remember the idea how to. Well, queen g6 looks pretty. Cross just queen d5 and that should be 7. But c5? Yikes, that was simple. Okay, okay. I failed a bit. Let's stop failing and let's solve everything correctly. Queen b3, if I don't make a check move or not g3 or g4, he will just mate me easily. So it's a, either g3 or g4 or rook h7, but then queen f5, so not rook h7. This is a g3 or g4. Let's see. Oh, queen e1. Queen e1 is also possible. Though I'm not sure if I really want position after queen trade on h4. Feels like I don't have so many ideas there. You can have g4. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. Well, when I said yeah, yeah, I didn't mean that it's correct. I just mean yeah, yeah, that there is this language I calculated is there. I really like g4. So basically, he's kind of zoog zwanged. I guess if he moves his skin. Yeah, because g3 here, g4, queen f4. See, I'm kind of zoog zwanged. Now if queen b3. Rook e6, queen b7, g3, g4. I did not want to choose it. I don't understand. Okay, that is good. Queen, queen here, here, rook here, bishop g2, I think queen of two is needed, right? I, I mean, I can't imagine this solution without it. Then I think capture. Yeah, now it's like rook f2, queen f2, and queen e2, which are my candidate moves. Maybe rook f1, but rook f1 is slow. Oops, and yes, rook a7. I think queen e2 is interesting. So queen e2 is bishop g2, my rook does not hang. But I'm not so sure what to do. Queen f2. Rook f2. Bishop g2, rook g2, king g2. I, well, there I have a draw. I'm not sure if draw is what <laughs> I need. I think now, of course, well. Maybe. Oh wait, queen of two, king h1, queen here, king here, rook here, here, that's made. Uh, wait, queen of two, bishop g2, rook f3. If he doesn't do anything, I have rook h3, queen h4 mate. Otherwise, I have queen g3, rook f2, and slowly like that, rook g3, I think. So, okay. No. Was so simple. Twenty nine thirty six. How did I manage to fail that? I'm not sure. Oh, I'm under check. Thought you just queen one, <laughs> mate. You can see that I was under check.
I'm not sure. That's what I can say for now, for sure. <laughs> that I'm not sure. Well, F5? Yeah, at least first move is correct. He, uh, but before can be two. Rook D1, Rook B1 seems good. Okay, Rook D1. He will probably play Rook a cheer and then he'll run and escape, right? <gasps> okay, Queen D6. Bishop here and I think he's fine, so Rook... Nice, 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 nice. After four in a row, you got a puzzle correct. No! <laughs> four in a row failed, I mean. Yeah, not, uh, not, not four in a row correct. I didn't have the best trick. Okay, well, let's see. Rook H3, King G5. Rook E5, King here. I'm not so sure what is good and what is not. I think like rook h3 is he correct? I think I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Just think. Maybe queen c8. I'm also not sure. Maybe queen d8. I'm also not sure. <laughs> uh, maybe queen d8 is good. So basically, if he doesn't nothing. I have rook h3, king g5, rook e5, he can play rook f5, king g4, I play. Then, and I'm not sure what to play. Maybe rook keep nah, nah, nah. So rook is three queen. I'm thinking about like this and then rookie three. Yes. It's only plus five, but it's better than plus zero. Mm hmm. Let's see what's here. I'm thinking about like, okay, well, rook h8, king g5, rook f7, then, like, I don't know, rook h4, and then, like, I don't know, king f1, for example, and then e f4, just, yeah, I'm not exactly sure if exact move order or so, but, but just an idea, just an idea. Mm -hmm. Maybe not, maybe not, not sure, not sure.
Rook here, can he? Uh, oops, Rook here, can he? Rook here. Basically, another idea which I thought about, like, I guess it's not really in puzzle with them, but, but like playing Rook F8, then Rook H4, King G3, then. Ah, well, it doesn't work. <laughs> Well, rook could change, right? Oh! No! Actually, was that a rook could What was it then? No? No. Let's see. G5? What? <laughs> Wait, what? Excuse me. No. No. I I'm a little bit confused, you know. Just a little bit. I'm not sure why is G5 correct. Ah. Oh. <laughs> now rook B1. No. I think I tried that. Wait, did I? I did not try that. Did I do? Can H3? Can F3? Ugh. Wasn't so sure. <laughs> and still not so sure. Was it possible? Okay. Rook B7 takes, takes. A 5d4, f6, d3, king e3, king c3, this is no. Rook b7, king c3. Rook b2 takes, king e3, king c3. f5, d4. King e2, king c2, f6. No. I'm not. Well, rook b7, that I think is. should gotta be correct. Because I think playing f5 now is passive and not really puzzle like. Maybe it is correct. Then I'll be really surprised if it is correct, to be honest with you. Oh well, I think I may have found something. So this, no matter where you move king, that can be 2. Uh, well, I think that. King c3, f6, d4, f7. Wait. 5? King c3. 3, 6, d4, f7, d3, yeah, that's way too slow. So he's forced to go d4, then I play king e4, he's forced to go king 3 protecting his pawn. f6, d3, f7, d2, f8, d1, queen f3, check, then that is a good trade, and I win. There we go. So, ah, that's the perfectest solving of all time. I was like 31, 64, and then 4 in a row. And then my biology rating. <laughs> so let's see today's plus nine actually. Oh, but today I started with 13, 34, 30. Okay, minus 16. Not something what is super awesome. Not super bad either. Just average. A bit less than average, let's say. Okay, let's see. D4. G6, right? Yeah, he won't play G6. G6! Oh la la! He will let me take. No! Haha! <laughs> he trapped me. Well, <coughs> he trapped me into thinking that he will give me a pawn. But technically, <coughs> I think he did not trap me. Oh wow! Oh! Is this what Snowbridge is playing? No, why did you take like Komodo? <laughs> I did A3. I did an A3. I just thought maybe that cheap sin may work, but it did not. Okay, Bishop 2 It's not so well developed, I guess. At E5? Here. 
guess you can eat D A D A three. Excuse me. I think if I played A three, I would have been zero point eight top. That would have been a bit better than that, though. Not com nah, I'm that was not complaining about my position. Just thinking that maybe next time, because with Komodos checked through time, it works against Stockfish. He doesn't play an ID4, so I think it does not work. <laughs> I can play bishop d6, though, preventing him from castle. Though you'll have knight f6, and then he'll castle. They basically just waste tempus. Ooh, that's interesting move. What? h5? Wow! That's pretty interesting. Didn't see that coming. Whoa! I'm gonna think. Maybe I have something. Maybe I don't have anything. <laughs> bishop b4, bishop a5, I want the ball. Okay, takes. E fork, we need two. Queen C7, yeah? Yikes. Yeah, we should be six. I reckon he's queen. So if you play queen c6, I have rook b7. I'm not so sure if it will be so good, <laughs> but let's try it. He cannot castle. So I think it was basically a rook trait. He has double pawns. He still cannot castle though. Haha. <laughs> that sounds cool, I guess. Whoa. <laughs> I think that's pretty well played from him. Um. Can it sh <laughs> I don't have pawn on h3. <laughs> Thank you, my pawn. You ruined all my chan No, all my hopes. <gasps> Whoa, that was actually smart. Oh, you can play rook h5, rook b5. Ah. That's it. Still think it was smart. Okay, queen c8 check. This is a weird game. <laughs> um, I think I'm a force to draw. You can six I would be better. But ah Go for a draw, don't go for a draw. I actually won't go for a draw. There is a fight. Ah! I'm not sure. Oh well. I'm gonna take. No. <laughs> Well, maybe then I can make it true. <laughs> maybe I'll accept it true. Huh. I'm, I'm going to shrink. I'm going to sink. Also, basically, queen b6. Here, rook b1, like here. I can give away my bishop because it will be this check. Hmm. Oh well. I don't know. I'll do it. Ooh. <laughs> no, he doesn't want to draw. Oh wow. Interesting. I'm not so sure actually. Can see six? He 
knight f8 won't be good. Plays like knight f6. I play bishop b7. He has queen b queen d5. Oh well, knight f6. I have rook b8. So he can play it. So I think queen here he'll he'll play rook h7. I'm a bit confused. Oh wait, let's not come out. I can't think for ten hours. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, queen six. Knight f6. So rook b8. Am I missing something? No. Okay, he takes. Oh, I take. Give it one takes. Um, I'm going to take this pawn. F. Four. Oh, oh. That seems scary. Maybe just d5 and push. There is rook e8. Ouch! Ouch, ouch, ouch. Okay, now, oh, oh, I'm scared. Okay, Queen eight, uh, yeah, Queen six, which confused in words oops <laughs> check d6 e2 d7 e1 d8 what is happening <laughs> well okay d6 wow <laughs> three queens on the board against level seven that's insane Oh, wow. With two queens, am I going to lose this? Ooh. I imagined it a bit better than that, actually. to lose that I think that was like a losable ah okay GG was it actually I mean yeah I guess it was losable but I think I was like completely winning oof see that this pawn hangs. Just that and that's unlosable. I need queen e8 and then e takes f. a4. Ah, I wanted to do that. I just 
that's it. Okay, three one three for me, four one one for him. Just how I just can't explain it. Uh, that maybe actually would have been better than the game, actually. Yeah, I think probably a draw sooner or later because. And I don't know, here like 24. Yeah, I'm not sure if I ever lost such a huge advantage against level. Yeah, against Stockfish. Plus almost 8. Rook H6. No. Maybe G4. I'm not sure. No. And B8, also no. King D8. Um. Wait, no. Knight F6, no. Knight B6, no. Rook G8, okay. Okay. <laughs> After that, I already won't be surprised if I lose against level 6 when I'll be plus 15. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I just don't know how. Did I blunder that position? <laughs> well, I'm already, I think, winning. Let's see. <laughs> Tread Let's see. <laughs> Will I lose it all or or no? Kid of fate. Wow, that's actually pretty weird. Move. I'm not sure why I'm complaining though, but okay. I'm not sure. Queen d5. <laughs> that move seems like it may be not so good, but it may be fine. I'm not sure. And I g5. Smash everything, maybe? Yeah, let's try it out. C96. Queen F3. Let's see. I think his knight is trapped. Knight A6. Knight A6. FC takes B. Yeah, basically, thank you for the knight. Uh, so now I am pretty sure there is very little chance that I will throw it <laughs> like previous game. But you never know. Else, yeah, I better went for a droid plus 7 <laughs> last game, I think. <laughs> it would be better. Yeah, I mean, yikes. I didn't see G4. I was like, well, Sir Quincy doesn't have anything. But I did have something <laughs> very, very strong. After this, something I lost. Ay, 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 ay. Oh well, let's forget that game. It will be hard to forget. Plus 7 against level 7. <laughs> Almost plus eight actually. Well, uh, let's forget this game just so I won't blunder this game also. Yeah, let's do it just for this. Let's all think it's maybe not so nice to hear how, how badly I played for five minutes straight or something like that. Okay, Rook C1. See what you like him. I don't want him to play d4. I just want to see win without sweating. But okay, I think he will. If he will play d4, I have knight g3, knight e4 maneuvers. Yes, he takes d. I think that is pretty hard to lose. Am I missing something or not? I think Stockfish has played so weirdly today. Yeah, level 7 got completely here. <laughs> okay, yeah. Wait, what? Oh, we don't have <laughs> It's still in my mind, I have a bishop here. Hmm. 
for silence but I guess I seen so something to really comment in that game right in this game okay primo let's let's try ledger checkmate and primos sinking bullet it will be useful GG, I know they am stockfish level 6. Yes, yeah, stockfish level 6. Say to your brother, next time you he won't get so lucky like he got today. Just say to him, please. Yeah, it just gave away peace already on move 5. Wow. I actually thought a 6 would survive. Ah, bishop 6, yeah. Three, whoa, three zeros for me, two nil one for me. So maybe actually that was good to <laughs> loss to level 7. I pre I warmed up against level C against level 7, so against level 6 I played beautifully. I don't know. So, I hope you enjoyed the stream. Thanks all for watching. If you did enjoy the stream, then feel free to join my team on chess, which I'll come. I'm my team 760 members, and come very, very much. 40 members, and I'll make it around once as a member, so we say we would happy. And also, feel free to join to my club on chess home, TM Fun Club, and my club there are 165 members, and we'll be very much, and 65 members, so we will make it around 200 members, and we say we would happy. And thank you for following on YouTube and Twitch, and as usual, please the button and subscribe me, and please on the video of Digital Chess and Club and Scom, and also please join Discord. If you join my Discord, you'll get notifications when I set the team on Twitch, and I'll post videos on YouTube. Link in the description. And yeah, bye bye, bye bye, see you soon, see you tomorrow, and have fun, see you tomorrow. stay cool.